Hello, hello, this is Mystic Mohawk, and I come to you today with the Divine Masculine read. So Divine Masculine is in the energy where he is. Holla, 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 Hey girl, let me holla at you, let me holla at you, let me holla at you, let me holla at you. So he can be in another energy where he can dick deal, baby. He's in that energy where he want to holla at anything with walk. He's in the energy where he wants to stick and lay anything that will walk. He's in the energy where he's trying to get his narcissistic supply back up. Yes, that will be divine feminine, divine masculine, sorry. He is in that energy where he want to holler at anything. He want to talk to anything because he is trying to get back up his narcissistic supply. Yes. So, um, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, let's uh see the energy. Why divine masculine is saying, let me holler at you, let me holler at you, let me holler at you, let me holler at you. Holla, 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 holla. Yeah, divine, ma divine energy. Why is he in this energy, divine? Our holy divine, why is he in this energy where he need to holler at anything? Oh, he's in the energy because he feel like the first icona that come out is the Empress. Yeah. He feel like that he cannot match the emperor's fly. He feel like this creative person, this person that's going through creative growth, this person that's now in a successful energy, this person is now going through a comfort of material wealth, this person that is going through security and protection from her ancestors, this empress, he feels like he cannot match her fly. What is the other energies that's going on with Divine Masculine? Why he's in a holla, 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 and everything he see, holla, holla, holla. Yes, he's in a holla, holla, holla energy because he feels like the scales of justice did not go on his side. He's feeling like that uh, everything has gone your way. He's feeling he's he has it and he will not take responsibility for his actions. And he feels like he is in a, in a situation where he cannot control his own problems. He cannot control his own agreements that he made with people. And therefore, this brings on disputes and arguments. And justice is not on his sky. The scales of lucky Libra does not go in the favor of divine masculine. What else do he feel? Yes, the spinner wanted to go to a Ten of Pentacles energy, baby. He feels like you are in a Ten of Pentacles energy where you are receiving your inheritance, girls. You are having material self, material wealth. You are and have received your security of success. You are going through, you have went through unconventional methods to succeed, receive your success. However, he see you shining through those methods that you use. And he see that you are in a ten of pentacles energy. And you got that. Dinero, dinero, dinero. Girl, don't you come up here, baby. Hey! Dinero, dinero, dinero. Hey, she got that money. We are broke. The galley, they have no joke. No, she got that bitch of galley. Her and Benjamin Franco stay at the Banco, spending cash like money everywhere that I go. Yes, that's Pepper song. Dinero, dinero, dinero. Hey, you should see her when I play that for real. She goes off. Dinero, dinero, dinero. Hey, dinero, dinero, dinero. I know that's right, PP. I know that right, PP. That pet pet. Yes. So anyway, let's just get into why Divine Masculine is in an energy where he want to slay that dangling. Yeah. We want to know why Divine Masculine want to slay that dangling. Slay that dangling. Yeah. Mmm, mmm, yes, we want to know. This will look out of place. Or oh, am I set tripping like clown shoes? I don't think so.
Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. We would like to know why is the guy masculine in a holler at everything he sees? Why he feel like he got to get his hood up? Why he feel like he have to have a whole stable of women? You know, why is these energies still on Divine Masculine? You know, we thought he was a grown man, you know? Yeah, people getting old in these lives, they still want to have a whole lot of women and things. What is all that about? Yes, and I'm using my dick dealer calls just to let that one be known. Yes, we are using the dick dealer calls. We want to know why this person, oh God, is dick dealing. Why are they still supposed to be in grown man energy, but they are dick dealing? We want to know, Holy Spirit, yes. This person is supposed to be grown, but they still dick dealing. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we shuffle these calls today because we want to know what is this person still in this holla, holla, holla at everything they see energy? Yes. Why is they still in the energy? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yes. Mm, so the first two calls that want to come out. Yes, because they still holding grudges against you, baby. So they feel like they can try to replace you, darling. So the first card that come out is still holding grudges. So Divine Masculine is still holding grudges against you, honey. Because you do not want them. They are plotting on your downfall. This is why these people feel like they got to get a whole bunch, a whole lot of people. And they are now in a, a relationship that, re, it, that is toxic. So the relationship, they are this this third party energy card come out and this is person interfering romantically with the third party. So Divine Masculine is in a her energy that the comet did to him what he did to you. And they are currently in a toxic relationship. So if you wanted to know what was the energies and why Divine Masculine is in an energy where he needs to replace people because the comic mm, put him in a third party. And now he can't come back to you because you're in an energy where you're unfazed. This call came out as the unfazed. So now he's in an energy where he feel like he's trying to replace you and he's also trying to place the recon the comic because she put him in a third party mm. and they are in an energy where they can't see things clearly now yes this call came out and it says can't see clearly so that is the energy of divine masculine at the current moment honey he can't see clearly because the comic put him in a third party and you don't want him back and he is still in narcissistic energy where he don't want a commitment. Yes. Mm-hmm. So he feels like he's going to go do a whole lot of replacements mm, to try to replace you and th the karmic. Okay? Yes. ring a ding dong He's going to be in that energy where he's going to sling that thing. ring a ding dong Ding dong ding ring -a ding dong ding dong ding he mad and envy because he wanna swing that dingy lane, honey. He's envious at you, baby, because you would not let him come along and sling his ding -a -ling, honey. He's envious of you, baby, because you are unfazed. The next card that come out is divine feminine, unbothered. He is envious of you, my dear. Because you are unbothered with his bullshit. And you will not agree to his third party, his options, because he not, because you know, Divine Feminine, that he's still in that no commitment energy. And she's saying, you got bad karma on you. Your ass deal with bitches with personality disorder. And she don't want none of that karma coming over there to her, says Divine Feminine. 
She also says, you know, you a liar, a gutter mouth gossiper about her. What you need to be doing is gossiping about your gutter mouth drunk bitch. What you need to be doing is worrying about your slick bitch. What you need to be worrying about is your lying ass loser bitch. This is what you need to be worrying about. Divine masculine says divine feminine. So let's break it down to you. Divine feminine says yes, the gossip is about you. Honey, your, the gossip is about you and your comic ass drunk bitch. The gossip is about you and your conspicuous drunk ass bitch. The word is about you and your lying ass bitch. The word is about your loser ass bitch, divine fem divine masculine. Yes, that's the bitch you choose, said divine feminine. She said, yeah, I know all about your magic. And I know about your girl that you went over there that you so-called picked that you said was better than I. She lives in the bed and she lives in her lower extremity because she is a mattress back. And her and her friends is continuing to do magic on you because this call came out is seeking assistance from the friends to do magic. So the friends is all into a little cult-like energy together. And this comic is always in an energy where she's having sex with one and looking at her phone. She's always in a facade. And the Divine Masculine is in an energy where he's sorry, not sorry. And Divine said, Feminine says, speed on before you get peed on. No, you're not sorry that you did it. You're sorry that you got caught and I, I found out about it. That's why you sorry. Says Divine Feminine. And Divine Feminine said what you thought was you had one that was going to do for you. And you had one that was going to take care of you and put in my place. But baby, you found out that yours was a mattress back. And now your feelings hurt. And now you trying to replace me because the mattress back replaced you. Because all she know how to do is use her lower extremities. The next card that comes out is... Freak in the sheet and hole in the floor. Sex kitten. Mm-hmm. But that's who you picked. And you picked her because you was fake flexing. And now you mad because the comic rejected you. Mm-hmm. And Divine Feminine says, both of y'all are happiness haters. Yo, you hating Divine Masculine. You hating my happiness because I don't want you and I blocked you and I moved on with your life. And call me, you hating on my success because I pulled my pink print back and would not let you know my moves. This is why you hate me. Mm-hmm. And Divine Feminine says, baby, but I really don't care about your issues because I'm still unbothered. I'm still unbothered. And she said, baby, I know you still style with me, me. This is why I don't put any pictures up. This is why I pull back all my energy, baby. But because I'm still unbothered with your cyber bully and your tactics. So the next come come out is unbothered. And this come come call come out is unbo unbothered by your cyber bully and your bullshit. Yes. And Divine Feminine said, and you are also, bitch, you are played out because you burnt your bitches. Continue to spy on me. Continue to see my success. So this call came out. is played out. Says Divine Feminine. You done burnt all your bridges, honey. And also, darling dear, continue to spy on me, baby. And watch my success, darling dear. Mm-hmm. You mad because your man chasing me. But she said, baby, I also know you chasing me too. So the next card that comes out is Sneaky Bitch. So Divine Feminist said, your man chasing me, I'm all up in his head, all up in his dreams. He mad because I blocked him and don't want him back. You sneaky bitch, you know that too. Mm -hmm. So the Chaser card come out and the Sneaky Bitch card come out, mm, says Divine Feminine. And she said, you made it my success. This is why you starting to pills. This is why you doing drugs. It hurt you that bad, baby, to see that I'm successful. But see that. Because guess what? You played a stupid game. And now you want a stupid prize. And that prize that you uh, so-called won is that you're triggered by my success. 
You're triggered that your magic did not work on me. You're triggered that I did not feed into your bullshit. Yes, because what you did, you put on a show, honey. This is what you did. But baby doll, you forgot that um this is my movie. I am the mech the I am the director. I run this shit. So you and your shows could hot trot somewhere else. Because what? I am still in the energy where I am telling you bitches to stay the fuck away. We are still in COVID-19. And this next card that comes out, avoid contact with sick people. Because she said, what? You made bad choices, baby. I have no time to deal with idiots. You stay on block. You stay on block, my friend. Because you know what? While you're still blocked, you're still seeking. And you're mad at my shine. The next card that comes out is your light. Your light irritates the demons. Divine feminine. Mm-hmm. They are extra triggered by your shine. What else is they extra triggered by, Holy Spirit? Ooh. They are extra triggered and destroyed by your set success. This is the first call. Destroyed. Okay. So, they are extra triggered. They are extra destroyed that you have morals, that you have principles, and that you respect yourself. They are shattered and fucked up. That you have morals, that you have principles, that you do not have to, and you don't and will not because you respect yourself. You will not involve yourself in a third party. And if a third party or entanglement presents herself to the divine feminine, she removes herself. This is why these haters want to tap into your energy. This is why these haters want to tag team all up and through your social media. Because they want to steal your energies. And our divine is saying, those that have been thinking about divine masculine... Those that have just started, just ended a relationship with a divine masculine, they are telling you, don't trust nothing about them. They ass is a lie. This next call is, don't trust nothing about them. They are still lying. And they see that a jackpot is coming for you. This next call is winning money, rich and heard it unexpected money for someone yes and divine masculine they name they name is your name because they try to be like you and gossip about you their name stay your name stay in their mouth and they found the pun about they are a wolf in sheep's clothing their shit don't work anymore so because their shit don't work anymore to try to get attention from another that will be the masculine. This car came out. I bust your windows out your car. So that one is still in an energy where, yeah, they don't, uh, <clears throat> they're not getting no energy from them. So therefore, they are saying, yeah, I'm going to bust your windows out your car. Because, baby, they look at you as an idol. They look at you as one that they want to be about. And they're one that see that you are not the one to deal with their mind fuckery and tell them with them, you win, you play a stupid game, you win a stupid prize. Divine Masculine, you played that game when you chose this comic. So the prize you got is the stupid, groupy like behaviors that you get from this whore. Divine Feminine said, I dusted my shit off with you and you lost your chance with me, says Divine Feminine. I dusted my ass off, and I'm telling you, you lost your chance with me. So continue to maintain your damn distance because your ass is blocked. You continue to stay with this toxic lover that you have. This next card that come out is taken advantage of, walked over, no control, possessive lover. Divine Feminine say, you staying over there with hope. Go on over there with that hoe and get the shit she do to you. Because she said, I know you are haunted. 
by the choices that you made and you are still curious about me you are still curious that i am winning so let's break it down divine masculine is haunted at the decisions that he made when it comes to divine feminine divine masculine is still curious about you divine feminine divine masculine is still over there in your energy where he see you too busy winning to think about him now He's over there with an energy, with a karmic, where she's always fighting with him over money. And she's always in an energy where she's telling others, let's go get a room. Because she's bisexual. She likes both sexuals, darling. And Divine Masculine is so confused about her sexual endeavors. He is delusional about the decision that he made. He's saying, I can't believe I picked one that liked the same thing that I like. Hmm. And the next card that comes out is unwanted options. Yes. This comic has options of the male and the female gender. Yes, darling. And Divine Masculine is in an energy where he's saying, Damn, damn, I picked the wrong one. I see the evidence in my eyes when I went through her phone. Mm-hmm. He thought you was going to be that woman crying. But he, this one is in reverse. That's a hell no. Divine Feminine is over there doing her. Yes. What is the other energies that he thought wrong? Yes. He thought that that one that he picked, he studied right. But he found out that one is a thought. Tiana, she stayed in a thought for like energy. This next call is, this one is always in an energy where she making sexual advances to other ones. This one always has sexual intentions for other ones, for others, yes. And he's tormented at the decision that he made. He's tormented that he picked the whore. Yes, let's say it like my Baltimore family in West Baltimore said. You whore. He picked the whore. Yes. Divine Masculine is tormented and he's in a hurtful, vengeful-like energy because he picked a whore. Yes. He picked a whore. That's crying out for help. This next card that comes out is crying out for help. Because she's always in an energy where she's a whore on the floor. And a freak in the sheets. Mm -hmm. And Divine Masculine is in an energy where he's knowing now that her and her family is fucked up. The next card that comes out, Divine Masculine is now finding out that she comes from a dysfunctional family. And she do dysfunctional things. And her and her friends is dysfunctional. Because this next card that comes out is tag teaming the hate. Sixing existence from the gate, from the haters. This is her and her friends tag teaming to hate on you, Divine Feminine. Yes. And Divine Masculine is in an energy where he found out that the Carmenic showing him fake love straight up to his face. You know that fake love that he gave you when you called him and he was also always with little JoJo them and lying and saying, yeah, I was out with my homies when all the time he was out entertaining comics. Mm -hmm. That energy... He getting that same energy back from the comic and he can't take it. Well, all right. Well, Divine Feminine over here and her energy where she's unfazed. She said, I know these bitches is out here copycatting on me. I know you want me back, Divine Masculine. I see you looking me up. Yes. So Divine Feminine is saying, you copycat bitch. I am still, I am still, no, that was wrong. I am unfazed with the copycat and shit. I am unfazed with the copycat and bitch. And I know you still want me back, Divine Masculine. This card came out. This is why you stay in my energy and constantly look me up. 
you am effing hater. That is constantly in an energy where you feel like you're going to tell me you was acting the way you act because you was under spell magic. Go have a seat. That's not going to work with me. I have came to the conclusion, masculine, that you showed me fake love because your ass got mental issues. It's something wrong with you. This next card that comes out is mental health. You need to check yourself. Check your head up there because the things that you do... Alpha males don't do. You have narcissistic behavior that you need to check at the door. She's saying, yes, baby. I know you gave me fake love. I know you showed me fake smiles, darling. This next card that come out is fake smiles. And for that, baby, you are receiving your karma, darling, dear. This is why she is in the energy where she's telling you, divine masculine, you played a stupid game. And you won a dumbass prize. And that was the comic. Yes. And she's saying she know that comic ain't no competition to her. How do you compete with me, comic, when you don't even compare to me? Says Divine Feminine. She's saying check yourself before you wreck yourself, baby. Get a reality check. You can never get up on my level. Get up on my level. Get up on my level. You can never be me, darling. What else is Divine Feminine saying to this bra? Yes, why is she even trying to? She saying she know you off the hook. She saying you, she know you always in trying to be her energy and burn evidence and say things about her. She said she pray for you, baby. She smudged her space. She said, yeah, your mind altering spells won't work on me, baby. Um... It work on the weak ones. My brain is too um, it's too uh divine for you to deal with, darling. And the next card that comes out is facts that you are a copycat bitch. You wanna be with me? Yeah, says divine feminine. Facts that you are obsessive lover and that you wanna be like me. Facts that your cloud, your uh, your judgment is clouded because you feel you know that you was defeated by me. The next card that comes out is clouded judgment and feeling defeated. Divine Feminine says she know all of this, baby. She know you are MF and backstabber. She know you are one that engage in third parties. She know you are one that is a clout chaser. She know you is one that comes from a dysfunctional family. And she said she also know you all want this coming reverse. That your spirit guys don't fuck with you. Yes. This next card that comes out is in reverse. Spirit guys, angels, ancestors. And this came in reverse. Divine Feminine says, I know your ancestors don't fuck with you. I know that you a motherfucking manipulator that ain't shit. I know you are a motherfucker that suffer from alcohol abuse i know you are a creative monster that started to steal my energy and be a copycat bitch i know you ain't nothing good for what that mouth do baby you ain't on my level i know that you all up in my energy trying to do beauty spells I know you all up in my energy trying to do candle magic. And you want to shut me up, but bitch, my mouth is big. And game over. What? Game over. You effing spiritual hater, says Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine said, I know you over there wasting your time on me, Carmen. Because you a spiritual hater. She said, yes, I know you over there wasting your time. You spiritual hater. But watch my hustle. Comic and divine masculine. Y'all hating. This is why y'all in an energy where y'all mad at my hustle. This is why you in the energy divine masculine where you want to ring a ling a ding dong. Swing that ding a ling over there to all these females because you trying to match one up to my fly and you would never do that. Yes. You in denial about this what? 
born to shine, says Divine Feminine. Yes, you are in denial that I was born to shine. This was already in my playbook when I got here, when I came on my mama's womb. And she's saying, this thing is OV, nigga. It's over. Wanna pull up on me. It's OV. All up in divine business. E. It's OV. Wanna call texting me. It's OV, nigga. It's over. And I drops the mic on that one. So you and your energy and your calming can stay over there, says Divine Feminine. So how do we want to move today, Divine? How do you want Divine Feminine to move? Oh, okay. So, our Divine wants you to know today... All things, whoever shall ask in prayer and believe, you shall receive, says Matthew 21, 22. What else do you want the collective to know, Holy Spirit, today? Watch and pray. Do not enter into temptation. Matthew 24, 41. So if somebody was over there thinking, don't do it. Don't leave into temptation. Seek and you shall find, says Matthew 7, 3. Okay, so I drops the mic and say, if you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe. Have a good day. Enjoy your day on purpose because you are great. Do that. Walk in your greatness. Stand in your power.